Hello there, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Avoid, and today we have a match of Tokyo vs. Revolutionary. I'm also joined by Ghost, which is a fantastic broadcaster. Sorry about the late start, but you know, we, we'll literally just get into it real quick. Anyways, so if I go ahead and introduce the teams on Revolutionary, our fraud model, another model, Slayer Curd, Swedas, and on Tokyo, we have Golden Boy, Greg, Sinistry, Dad, and Light. So as we can see right now, the OD box is dropping in the middle right now. The shaft is scoping, does take out one player. Sinistry trying to make an attempt to go for that OD box, but Golden Boy is there to take the OD box. Slayer Curd going for an attempt to pull the flag, but he is a little bit low and not much support there, and he will get taken out. Yeah, literally not much is happening here. Um, we can see Slayer Curd up against um, Light here. Fraud having a little bit of trouble there because he's low. See you guys in the chat. Best commentator. I don't know, man. Try my best. But hopefully you guys enjoyed the stream today. So you can see Slayer Curd with the Tesla, dealing much damage as possible, but he gets taken out. Model trying to slow down the Pala, which is called Dad. I ain't calling him that, I'm just gonna call him Pala. He needs to change his name, I ain't calling him that. Anyways, back to the game, you can see Fraud and Slayer and Model pushing up a bit more aggressive now, but all of their players on Tokyo have OD, so they might use for defense if they feel it's necessary. And the OD box is also dropping middle. Uh, maybe the model Vite could have taken, but I guess his OD just spawned in now. So maybe as a use and take situation, but no, they don't. Greg uses the OD. He kind of hits the wall there. I don't know what was going on, but it happens. Um, model is there, having no supplies there, and will get taken out by Greg. This might be a pivotal moment as we can see Sinistry using that Eris OD right now. Nice OD from Light. They might be able to pull the flag here up against um, Tokyo. Tokyo looks like they are backed up in the corner here. As Sinistry might be able to take out some players. And that hair is pulling the flag here. He's a bit low HP, but no, he gets taken out. And Model will be able to return the flag. I don't know, guys, in the chat, what do you guys think? Do you guys think that Tokyo is going to win? Do you think Revolutionary is going to win? I want to hear you guys' thoughts. I want to hear you guys' opinions, you know? You can speak your voice now, in it. Let your voice be heard. See someone in the chat saying Tokyo's gonna win, but Golden Boy activating his bike in OD here, but does get taken out because he's a bit low there. And the Paladin has used his OD, but fraud there, I don't think that OD was necessary, fraud. I don't know, maybe he was bugging there a little bit, but anyways, back to the game, we can see Golden Boy pushing up on the left side with, with the Pala and the Ares here, which is Sinistry. Might be able to go for a pull here as Greg is also playing aggro with Shaft and Cruz. You don't see that every day, honestly. I'm going to be real. Man should have been back on defense here, but it looks like Tokyo are going for the aggressive gameplay here as Light is also trying to make an attempt to pull, but he's low and he does get taken out there. 
With only four minutes, 30 seconds left on the timer, we really need a game changer right now because right now it is looking like a sluggish start and no teams have captured any flags at the moment. Ah, uh, we can see this might be something here. I think the Odie Bots is also dropping middle right now, but Slayer Card and Golden Boy trying to make an attempt to get it. But no, hold on, this might be attack for Revolutionary as a Palo use, but Greg, oh my, Greg misses his Odie. Nice Odie from Sweet Ass. Oh my gosh, Tokyo is looking like they're in some sort of kerfuffle here as Model is, is the Viking trying to pull here, but Model is low here. He doesn't have much support, which is unprecedented there. If he had some support, it would have been nice, but nice ODs, it's just that they didn't have enough HP to deliver the flag as required. Only two minutes, 50 seconds left on the timer. Maybe, maybe we might see something because it usually happens when there's only a few minutes or seconds left on the timer. Someone goes for a pull. We can see Model here pulling the flag with Vike, but he bumps into the wall. Maybe he can go up there and Greg gets taken out and they will be able to capture the flag. This is looking very, very promising for Model. Model, jump down. What are you doing? What are you waiting for? There's no, t there's literally barely any time. Oh my day, this time wasted. Hair yeah, model should have just went. No way. Maybe model, which is the Honda, can use. Nice, nicely done. OD Bots is dropping middle now. Golden Boy using his bike OD. Nice OD from the cruise. But Sinistry decides to use his Eris OD a little too late here. And that does cost the team their flag. As we can see, nice capture there from Revolutionary. Does surprise us all with the first capture already with only 1 minute 50 seconds left on the timer. And we've seen Tokyo really trying to play aggressive here. They don't want to lose this round because we can see Golden Boy here making an attempt to pull the flag. No repair here, but he's slow so he will get taken out. Light is also coming in a little too late. Ah, uh, good eyes there, uh, I sit, um, because I didn't even see, um, I didn't even see that. I honestly didn't see that. So props to you in the chat. Um, I said, Chennai, however you pronounce your name. Um, but we can also see light hair pulling the flag with his hunter hair for Tokyo. You can see a few players on Revolution. He is on respawn here. He has some support. So light will be able to capture this flag for trying to step in here trying to do some damage but fraud is getting blocked by the paladin and that is going to be a capture for tokyo with only a few few minutes and a few seconds left on the timer and they really shocking us at the last pivotal moment of the game Yeah, I mean, the same thing and the same thing I'm saying. It's a big wow. I really don't know what happened there for Revolutionary to pull up to to cause Tokyo to pull. But we can see Model Hair using his bike OD hair. Golden Boy is hiding here. So, as we pretty much can see, the very first round was left in a draw here in Highland. So, we got five more rounds to go. So, let's see. Anything can happen in the in the future games. So, it's not over.
Yeah, there was back in the day, like in esports when we were hosting like tournaments. Back then, there were friendly fire enable in like light format, XBBP, but that was like quite a while back. And to be honest, it wasn't too bad actually. It was pretty nice. Uh, it really does determine that you have to have skill and not to shoot your own teammates. So if your teammates line up with your enemy, you have to make the right decision. Is it worth it to to take the shot and so forth? But the OD bots does get taken by Muddle, which is the Viking for Rev, which is the hunter for revolutionary, I should say rather. It's funny when they try to take the nuclear. I mean, I totally agree, but, you know, the nuclear does create a very intriguing difference in the match because one nuclear box might determine a win or a loss. But anyways, we can expect both teams to be self-destructing right now and the games will begin shortly. Oh, nah, OD's friendly mode. Friendly fire with OD's, that absolutely wouldn't work. We can see Golden Boy and Greg here controlling on the right side with Light. Maybe this might be something here. If Light can push up was with some support from Greg, this might be something. They need to take out the Ares, then the Shaft, and then they might be able to do something. Odibots is also dropping middle. Model might be able to do a use and take situation, but he's too low. Greg might be able to step in and take, but Model manages to swoop in just in a nickel time and does take the Odibots. I believe both teams are literally underwhelmed by their previous performance in the last round as both of them might be surprised of what's happened. Model does flip there. Don't know maybe if something was on the ground for him or something. But Greg here on the right side um, with Fonda here dealing some damage against the shaft here. Good, good shots from him. Yeah, Greg's way too low to be taking that flag, but that and light on the opposition time. Maybe they can pull the flag, but there's not much support there. And model and Swedas is holding down the defense. The Audi Watts is also dropping mid. Sweet ass, nice OD from Sweet ass, but I don't think it was meant for him. I don't think he wanted to deliver that out to him, but either way, it still dealt some damage to a player. But Greg here pulling the flag for one sneaky pull there from Greg there. Greg, no repair. Maybe Model might be able to slow him down. Model will return. No, he doesn't. Golden Boy coming there to save the day. As we can see, Eris OD, literally, this might be one of the best Eris ODs that have been delivered this game. But Model activating his bike OD. He's not giving up just yet, but Model does get taken out. Greg here with Cruz. Vonda, he might be able to pull and capture the flag, but the shaft doesn't do enough damage and Greg is able to capture the flag. And that's going to be a first flag for Tokyo. It looks like the Paladin making another attempt to pull the flag here. No repair, does get taken out. Maybe Golden Ball can use his bike OD, but he's too low here. And I think he analyzes that and he think he's not going to use just yet. Wow. That was just flawless performance from Tokyo there.
Slayer card. Yeah, Slayer card is good, man. I agree. His his performance has been phenomenal. Uh, phenomenal, I should say rather, but it might not be enough for revolutionary today. Fraud using his Eris OD here. A use and take situation. This might be nice. Nice OD there from Fraud. I'll give him that. I'll give him that. See the Paladin on the right side activating his Pala OD hair with the with the Vike. The Hunter coming in with a little bit of support, but Golden Boy is going sneaky here, trying to make a to pull, but he's too low, so he won't be able to get away in time. So Slayer with his Pala, he's a bit too low. He left his OD to run out there, but I don't know. Greg here making an attempt to pull the flag here. Model and the two models there. It looks like they were teaming up for a defense there just to return the flag. What's here? Ah, I see you at your hair active. Nice OD there by Greg. OD bots is dropping mid. I guess that was a use and take scenario for Greg. Maybe Greg can take, but he's going to leave for the Vike. Oh, but Suidas really does really be a nuisance there by using that cruise OD, sending the Vike back on to respawn. He was not letting that Vike take. That was a really a crucial moment for revolutionary because if that viking did take that would have been a nuisance for them for the next four minutes remaining on the timer the paladin using his od here he has to camp a little bit because that's a short range weapon he won't be able to do much in this scenario but the tesla bulls manage to reach them and he does do a little bit of damage there which is still good Slayer card and fraud, but nice OD from light on the two players there, putting them back on respawn there. But Suidas is locking in. He may he's making sure none of them pull, but Golden Boy and Greg might be able to do some shots from right. Nice OD from Model. This might be something here as we see the two models teaming up together, trying to make a attempt to pull here. But their defense on Tokyo is on lock today. But Fraud coming in with his Ares OD a little too late. If that came in maybe a few seconds earlier, that would have delivered the beautiful, beautiful pull there for Revolutionary. Nice ODA by there from Sinistry. Does leave a window opportunity, but the model Vike does use light, needs to wait a little bit. But his OD does run out, and the two model and Slayer Cut is able there to return the flag. Wow. Remarkable gameplay there from Revolutionary and just it's really sluggish gameplay here but Swedes here might be able to pull the flag but he has no repair he's going up because he does want to get any damage dealt but Greg does spawn behind him but like he can't drop down he's in a sticky situation but he decides to jump down but no support there from his teammates which does lead for a return and there was also a counter pull going on on the other side which was interesting but they didn't get too far with the flag which was the Paladin Yes, we can see Greg 
Greg's a little too low to get away in there. With only 1 minute 25 seconds roughly remaining on the time mark. And we can see Tokyo is leading with one flag currently at this stage. Golden Boy activating his Vike OD there. It was a use and take scenario. Maybe he can take up model. The Golden Boy is a little too low. Greg using his cruise OD. This is a crucial moment that Greg used it. And he analyzed that that was the best scenario for him to use. But they don't get away in time. Maybe Greg can still pull here. This is something, as long as someone focus sweet us, which is the sharp locking him, which Sinistry does. Sinistry might be able to jump down and take out model. Yes, model does get stuck there a little bit. We can see the Paladin also pulling here with only the A and Nitro. He has DP now, so he might be able to deal some damage on the way, but he is a short range weapon. So that is going to be another capture from Tokyo. Wow, what an astonishing turn of events there with only a one minute left on the turn and they still managed to pull that flag. Wow completely re redefining expectations honestly Tokyo is really pushing So we will have another map that will be played. The next map will be... Uh, it will be Iran. So two maps will be played in Iran. Ah, I see you. I see you in the chat, Shutter. I think you you might be right about this. Tokyo does look like the stronger team in these scenarios. I mean, what do you guys think? Like the past two rounds that they played, they really was really looking like the more dominant team there. Like really, it does go to show that their defense was masterclass and they were dominating the field. There is really not much I can say there. <laughs> uh, another rack watch scared you now, bruv. Did I, did I give you a jump, bruv, or something? So the players will be joining up shortly. We're just waiting for them to be ready.
Khaled, Khaled, I'm doing well. How are you today, Khaled? It really is a beautiful day. We can see Tokyo really showing their dominance. And honestly, what do you think? Do you think Tokyo is going to secure the bag and go home away? Go home with the win, I should say. I appreciate it. I appreciate it, man. Um, pack it. I mean, it's, not, it's a good achievement for my short performance on on the new sports mode. I'm new to it. It's only been a month, so I'll take my lucky seven, you know what I mean? It's a nice paint. I think it's just underrated on its looks. I know Mr. Ghost, you know, Ghost, he kind of, he kind of smirks at the paint, but it's a nice paint, bruv, honestly. So there will be a tech pause. Tech pause for five minutes, guys. Palo was trying to violate. Mm. I mean, yeah, to apply for an esports um, team, ideally would be tanky sport, yeah. And if there is, you can also go on the tanky sports Discord and you should be able to find a team that is recruiting in the recruiting channel and maybe message one of them and see if they will accept you um there's nothing wrong with the stream there's just um tech pause that's going on so the stream will start again shortly once the tech pause is over so it's roughly two minutes have left until the tech pause is over
right, so just a quick update. Both teams are resetting right now. And the teams are joining up, so. Yeah, I mean, I mean, you're totally right. It would be nice if they have like a description or a slow, low, like a just a few words that they can put behind their name. It would be really nice. But I don't know if you had a, let's say you had a team and you had a logo, just theoretically, let's say you had one shutter, right? What would you put your slogan, slogan or your description as? It's back to the game. You can see both players, or both teams rather, they have self-destructed and the game has begun. We can see Model up against Greg here, dealing some damage. And Slayer occurred and Swedas trying to hold on defense against Golden Boy as Golden Boy and the Pala is on the top being a nuisance there. Nice shot there from Model. Yeah, as we see Golden Boy here make an attempt to pull the flag through middle there. But the Vike is a bit a bit, little bit too low there. And Greg is coming in a little bit too late as well. Sinistry does look back to do some damage on shots, but like also going for a pull here. He's going to have to camp there a bit. And someone does spawn on him. So he's in a little bit of trouble. But Model going for a counter pull here. A solo here. Maybe. Yeah, it doesn't look promising as right now. The OD bots is also dropping middle. This looks like a use and take situation as Golden Boy does use and take and focuses anyone that wants to pop out from hiding and Golden Boy does punish them for it. We can see Light also slowing down the Viking there, just being a nuisance there with Freeze. Freeze in this map is just so powerful when you know how to use it. Yeah, we can see Slayer and Fraud there up on the right side playing aggro here. This might be something, this might be a pull here, but they're too low. Too many on defense there for them to get away in time. And Fraud will get taken out. That going for a counter pull here, but so many on defense. Same situation, same scenario that occurred on the opposition side.
Sinistry was looking for that window opening to use the Ares OD through mid so they can pull a flag but that opportunity has long gone. We can see Greg dealing some damage to Fraud as Fraud is doing so much damage. Greg might go for um, a self. Oh, he's going to pull. Greg is pulling. Wow. Nice shot there from Sweetass. Sweetass does put off. A stop on that. Models using his cruise, but does not hit anyone there. Maybe he wanted to carve his name out on the wall. Who knows? The Paladin activating his Pala OD, pulling the flag. Golden Boy also activating his bike OD. Nice bike activation from him. Slayer going for a counter pull, but he is alone and he's surrounded by three players there. But Model is also slowing down the players, which can be so frustrating. Maybe Model might use, but Greg. Using his cruise OD does leave for opportunity. Model does use and model does go for a return there. So that's a little bit me messy. Maybe Sweetas might be able to use hair, which he does so nicely. But light is also going for a counter here. Wow, we're only 5 minutes 45 seconds left on the timer, you can see it does going to look like we're going to have a standoff here for quite a while, Sinistry does have an Aeris OD but he's alone so it doesn't make any sense he's using just yet. The Aeris is on spawn. They need to clear that Aeris fast which is fraud on spawn. Fraud is looking like he's in a little bit of trouble here. The Pala chooses to activate his Pala OD here. But the Ares does use, the Ares does pick up on their mistake. Oh my days. I don't know what Sinistry was doing there, but it looks like maybe um, he had the wrong idea of the target and he does hit the wall there. Pala going for some damage on Slayer there. Slayer does get taken out. He's too low. Ridas and Slayer pushing up on the left side, being a little bit sneaky, but they do they do get focus here now because they do get noticed. The OD bots is dropping middle right now. Maybe they might leave for the Vike, but Golden Boy is there once again to do some damage if required. But Golden Boy is a little too late there. And I believe one of the players on Revolutionary did take the OD. It looks like it was the Eris that took. Okay, Fraud did take. Not bad, not bad. Let's see what Fraud can do with it. Slayer, nice rooker shots from Slayer there. Mm. Fraud is there alone, so he can't necessarily use now. But he does use. Wow. 
Nice OD from Fraud, which does lead for a return there. But Muddle also using his cruise OD. This is a pivotal moment of time right now, as we can see that Revolutionary will be able to capture the flag with only 2 minutes 25 seconds left on the timer. They might try and pull again, but they're too low here. Maybe Muddle might be able to go for a pull here and use his Hunter OD. Uh, we can see the Pala activating his Paladin OD. The Vike Golden Boy does activate his Vike OD, but he's going for a use and take scenario. Fraud is trying to take that OD, but the Vike is going to be more powerful in that scenario there. And the Vike Golden Boy does take. I uh, see why he's living up to his name now. He's just showing the performance of taking the OD bots in middle. We can see Golden Boy and the paladin pushing up on the right side maybe they might all use here that's just so many surrounded golden boy should have just used right there and pushed aggressive but this is the scenario is gone the situation that would have been absolutely significant it's gone now golden boy could have used there but greg here picking up on any mistakes doesn't let it bother him but Swedas does not give them an opportunity to pull any flag and Model will return for Revolutionary. A bit of server lag there. But we can see Golden Boy and Light playing aggressive. Maybe Light might be able to pull and use his OD. If he's in a little bit of trouble, use, 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 use OD. Light, nah, no time. But Greg does use a cruise OD. Maybe he had a little bit of um, kerfuffle there. He, he does say it was lag in the chat. But I'm going to leave it up to you guys to decide. Was Greg lagging there? Why he uses OD on himself. But Sweetheart's here. Making an attempt to go for a pull. But he is too low. So, But Sinistry doing a use and take scenario. Maybe Light can get some heal from that. Which he does get a slightly little bit. But Slayer Cod is also there for defense Sweetheart's also having some trouble there as he's just playing it safe here as he knows he's low and he's just trying to be a distracting there for maybe a, with a few minutes few seconds left on the timer i didn't even really noticed there was so little time left but revolutionary does take that round which is surprising <laughs> Golden Crown I said what's Greg playing at? Uh listen man, you are, you're gonna have to take that up with Greg, not me. I honestly don't know what happened, but he did say it was lag. Let's just say it, let's call it and say it was lag. Cause I don't really see why Greg would have done that to himself, you know? That's what I gotta say. <laughs> Uh, so it does look like Light was able to take the OD bots that did drop.
So back to the game, you can see Light Hair pulling with his Hunter, has some support from Greg. The freeze does get taken out. That was going to slow Light down. But Fraud, nice shot from Fraud there, holding down the defense alone, a solo player there. Greg there trying to make up for his mistakes for the last round. He does pull the flag, which is nice from Greg. Maybe Greg can capture this flag, I believe so. He's going for the repair scenario here. Slayer there, too low to go for the return. And that's going to be a catch off for Tokyo. Like using this Hunter OD. This might have been the best Hunter OD that's been used this this game, honestly, against Revolutionary and Tokyo. Wow. Wow. Model does take the OD bots middle. Maybe he might use yes but the pilot does pick up on it and he does not go towards him he's just gonna go for shots on cruise which is nice to see but the pilot is too low no support there and it looks like light might try and return but the hunter does use his od beautiful od from model there with the hunter outstanding performance wow That was really a counter pull and a capture for Revolutionary. You see Greg is too low, Fraud just going to try and take out him if he can. You can see damage dealt from Fraud there. Two center street holding on defense, but Fraud doesn't notice that there's two people from right side focusing him. This might be something for Tokyo as they are playing a bit aggressive here, but the pallet is low, so Greg might be able. Oh, nice OD from center street. Oh my gosh. This might be something here as long as Slayer doesn't use, which it wouldn't be the best scenario, anyways. He's too low, but nice pull from Model. Nice OD from Fraud also. Oh. But the light player does take. Maybe he uses now. Oh my days. That is absolutely outstanding performance. Oh my gosh. The intensity that was happening there at the last moment. And this guy still managed to return that. With his Honda OD, wow, it seems like Light is doing something. He's delivering high performance and he's showing Revolutionary that what they're about and they're not letting Revolutionary get away with any wins today. Nice ball from light there. Light will be able to capture it. Nicely done. Sinestri dealing some shots to fraud. Slayer card going for a pull here. He does not notice that there's people behind him, but he has some support from Golden Boy. But Slayer card needs to watch out because he's going to get some damage dealt from mid and from left. Wow. So right now we can see two players on 
Tokyo with ODs right now. Model does have an OD on the opposition side, which is for Tokyo. Nice OD from Model. He decides to use their leading for a window opportunity for Swedas and Slayer to push on. But Greg activating his cruise OD, a crucial moment that he does require to use that OD, which was necessary for defense there. And that does put Revolutionary back on their defense. But hold on, another counter pull. Aggressive play from Light and Model here. Odie Watts, who's going to take this Odie Watts? It's, it's really a fight, to be honest. Slayer Code going sneaky, but yeah, the Pala does pick up on it and doesn't let him pull. Greg and Sinistry free on right. This is not looking good for Revolutionary right now. They need to hold down defense right now because Light has OD. The Pala activating their OD. Revolutionary is under a little bit of pressure. Maybe Light can use hair. No, he doesn't. He has repair hair. So he might use on... Nah. Nah. Unlucky. With only three minutes left on the timer, we can see Tokyo is leading with three flags at the moment. Sinistry pushing up on the right side, just trying to go for splash damage. Nice splash from Sinistry. A bit of server lag there. Sweetas going for a pull here. And Sinistry does use hair. This is absolutely magnificent. We can see that's going behind the back of the base. Does he have... OD and he does peek out and say hello I'm here but Swedas does get taken out with his OD that was activated by the Viking and the Paladin will also be able to capture here but Fraud using his Aeris OD does put them back on defense there and try to hold down the fort a little bit there but the Pala might be able to capture but hold on then a little bit of kerfuffle here it's looking a little bit hectic as they're trying to pull here but golden boy activating his vibe od for defense here and a use and take scenario which is nice models hiding sweetest hiding none of them peeking they don't want to pick the bike nicely done nicely done a bit messy there but still does the work regardless Model going sneaky for a pull with his Hunter Freeze, but Light is also there to deliver something if he does pop out from the corner and he doesn't want to find out what Light has for him and he runs right into Light. And Dad will also be able to return the flag here. Um, Sweetass going for a pull here. Maybe Sweetass is too low and Greg will be able to hold on the defense. I see in the chat Slayer saying, Model, you can use your OD for position. Maybe they have a vision. Let's see what model, let's see what Slayer will use. But nice OD from Model. Yeah, so you don't want to peak Golden Boy when he's using that bike OD. With only one minute remaining on the timer here, you can see Slayer on the top platform there. He might be able to do some ricochet shots off that wall onto the pallet that's down there, which is annoying. OD is also dropping middle. We can see Revolutionary kind of camping it out. Maybe Fraud can take this OD. Nicely done. Model also going for a counter pull with only 35 seconds left in the timer. Oh, but Sinistry does put a hold on that. Mm. Oh, a counter pull is going on. With only 15 seconds remaining, maybe Tokyo said... Maybe they're going to take Revolutionary to Tokyo because after this round, they're going to have to take a trip there and have a... Oh, but I take it back. Revolutionary does go for a return there and it still doesn't make much of a difference. That round does go to Tokyo.
So the last round, the last two rounds that will be played, will be played in Sandal. So just a quick update guys, for the very first round that was played in Thailand, it was a draw. It was a draw and uh, the second one, Tokyo won that, the second round in, in Thailand, the third one, which was Iran, third match, Revolutionary won that, and then the fourth round, um, Tokyo won that, which was just now. So now we have two more matches, or two more rounds, I should say, rather, for Sandal, which will be played. And maybe we might see something interesting in Sandal. So we do have the map, and we will be joining shortly so we can get you guys up to speed. <laughs>
<laughs> so right now we can see both teams camping on the middle bit for waiting for the OD as well. So I don't think anyone has taken it yet. So they are self-destructing right now. This will be the last two rounds that will be played in Sandal. So let's see what will happen this round. The OD bots is dropping middle right now. Players camping, waiting for the OD bots to drop down and for them to swoop in and take it. Golden Boy is a little bit too low. Fraud is low, but the Palafor Tokyo does manage to take it. So he's going to be able to maybe capitalize on that on the later of the game. As the game does progress on a little further, we can see some players do look a little bit um, afraid here. As Greg is trying to pull here, but he's a little bit too low there, so he won't be able to get away in time. Alright, we can see Fraud and Sweetas controlling on the left side, dealing some shots to Greg. They take out Greg. Sinistry is next. This dish, dish out some damage to him now. Sinistry is low. But Light also going for a pull here. The pilot and the Vike on the going for a counter pull here. But the defense for Revolutionary is saying no, no, not today. And they do put those two players back on respawn that was playing for Tokyo there. Model and Slayer dealing some damage to Light. Nice recur shots from Slayer. This might be something here. But Slayer won't be able to get those last few shots off as we can see Light and the Pala, which is also pushing on the left side. And Golden Boy seems to be camping there. I wonder if he's waiting for the OD. It's he does the od bots is dropping right now maybe he can sweep in and take that but models also camping there a nice shot there from greg does deliver some damage that was required to take out the bike like camping there a little bit being a distraction for the pala but the pala does get taken out Nice OD from Light again, really dishing out that OD and showing Revolutionary. This is a new Revolutionary for them. <laughs> Maybe they might be able to pack their bags after the next upcoming rounds. But Revolutionary is not giving up yet as Model tries to activate his, his Hunter OD but doesn't get off in time. Golden Boy with, uh, with Vike OD, does he use his OD just yet? Oh, he's going to save it. Maybe he's going to save it for the right time. Nice, uh, nice shots from Light. Maybe, oh. But Light is pulling hair, but the Pala, yeah, the Vike does use, I don't think that was necessary because the players were low. OD boss is dropping middle now, piloting, activating his pallet OD. Maybe he's going for a pull here, but Golden Boy would. Oh, nice OD by Sweetass. Sweetass wasn't giving him that opportunity. And he does take the take the OD and they're going for a pull here. Slayer and Model pulling through middle. Nice support there. Nice support structure. But Golden Boy does put a stop on that. Leaning some shots, but Model does flip and kiss the floor. Fraud might be able to take over and use Eris OD like this. Nice OD from Fraud there absolutely outstanding performance by fraud there fraud coming in giving some shots to golden boy maybe fraud is low he will get taken out light and the pala is coming aggressive for return there but slayer and model needs to do some damage but no sweet ass only does miss the requirements and it does not hit the player that was supposed to be hit Wow. That was...
That was absolutely magnificent. You could have just seen how Tokyo was being relentless there and they weren't giving up that flag so easily there. Golden Boy and Light going for attempt to pull the flag here. Suidas and Models there to go for defense. Greg Gibb dealing some shots, but Frauds alone here trying to hold on defense there. Slayer does look back with Model dealing some damage dealt, which is required, and they do take them out and they do control back their base again. Suidas, Froda. OD mid, nice shot from Suidas. Yes, Greg is in a little bit of trouble. He's one HP here. Oh wait, what what do we see here? We see a pull going on here, and we can see aggressive gameplay going on the counter side. Suidas starts trying to get a little too far. But Model does use his Vike OD for defense there. But Slayer will be able to pull again. Oh, nice OD from Light. This is now never Light. You have to do something here. But it does look like Revolutionary will capture this flag for this round. Well done. Wow, they really are giving Tokyo a little bit of a hard time here. Golden Boy pulling the flag here. Mm, not much support. I just wonder if Tokyo are trembling on their knees right now as maybe they do feel the pressure up against from Revolutionary and they are getting surprised by Revolutionary's performance. The OD boss is also dropping in the middle now but Golden Boy does do a use and take scenario. Does get taken out before he can get any more shots off. Pala pushing on the left. Hunter might be able to do some damage. Golden Boy swooping in with his Vike OD. He might be able to do something here if he does use and clear out the base, but he doesn't need to use just yet. Not just yet. Now he uses absolutely was required to use there, using for defense and attack there. Sweetass using his OD. Greg goes for cover. Nice OD and cover from Greg there. Maybe Sinistry might be able to take over this if. If Sinistry does, Sinistry use for defense if you need it. If you need it, only if you need it. Nice capture there from Tokyo there. Golden Boy also going for another pull here. Fraud using his OD here. With only one minute, 20 seconds left on the time and the pressure is on. They are trying to pull hair, but this is promising for Tokyo. We can see Tokyo is snatching the flag once more again and pulling. Slayer card is low here and the Pala will be able to capture the flag, but no, he gets taken out. But Light is coming in for support to capture that flag and Revolutionary won't be able to do anything much here as there's only one minute left on the timer and Tokyo is leading with two flags right now. And the pressure is on for Revolutionary with only 50 seconds left remaining. Sweetass with OD, Pala activating his OD for defense and to do some damage on right, but the Pala is under pressure here and it looks like maybe, just maybe, Tokyo might take this win today.
Wow, a lot of kerfuffle going on there. Wow. And that game does go to Tokyo for that round. So guys, first round was a draw. Tokyo, Tokyo won the second round, revolutionary. Um, won the third round, Tokyo won the fourth, and they won the fifth round. There was also one more round that could have been played, but Tokyo has three wins already. So it does look like Tokyo will go home today with the win, and that looks like it's it, guys. Honestly, I don't think there will be any more because Tokyo has three wins now. Um... Okay, it does look like does look like that is game, guys. So, <laughs> props to Tokyo for taking the win today. I do believe Tokyo will be going on to the next stage now, and they have secured Gladiator in the bag. So, outstanding performance from Tokyo. Well played for Revolutionary. They just they almost got their graphs on the win, but. Anyways, guys, thank you for Ghost for broadcasting, absolutely broadcasting skills there. And my name is Avoid. And guys, thanks for tuning in and watching. And we are out. Good night. Peace.